We got Banax and our Ghosty Goose, so that's not a bad start. Yeah, I'm thinking 11 up those boys is a good idea. Um, maybe I should steer away from using Tear Jewel in future builds and start leveling up somebody else who's also a melee. Bomb better chest early on this is a pretty good deal. Um, no, I want the half a heart. Hebrom has died of old age. Great. Okay. Yeah, because I feel like Tear Jewel does come in clutch occasionally. But if I had more help with the melee and I wasn't getting damaged as much, I wouldn't need the clutch. You get what I mean? Which is my illogical reasoning for it. But then it becomes a factor of, I gotta train somebody up to do that. And that's a lot of stuff. Um, we might as well hit up heart. Heart, dupe, dupe. Okay, I think that's the path we're gonna go. Because so, we get blue hearts in here sometimes. I know the rhythm, the sturdy be that hard, it could only be mine. Wayward heart, return at last. Crusader, hollow my chest yearns for a reunion. May I? Sure. Oh! Oh, oh, I'm happy and I'm sad. So I weep, I laugh, I love. Thank you, Crusader, for what you have done. <sighs> Freaking heart gets stuck again. Okay, so... Tear Joel lives with Ratu now, I guess. Like, what did he give us? I wish I could have that blue heart. I earned it. But I digress. I lost Tear Joel for that heart. What is that? Money and death? Death and taxes? I don't know. Let's see. Double gold, enemies drop poison. Oh, okay. Did I just, like, sacrifice Tear Joel to that guy? Like, is he gonna be in my town anymore? <laughs> That'd be funny if it was just like, yeah, no, Tearjill's just now gone. Like, I spent so much time leveling up my murderous unicorn. Whipping guy. Hate the hammer. Eh. Sword. I'll take it. Plus it's godly, so that's a good sign. Uh... Gotta love godly weapons. I still like my ghosts. I think they're the most convenient one. I can just, boop, rip a hole in hell. Okay, get another card. Hey, bub. Gotta do it. Oh yeah, I already grabbed the one for this run. Okay, we'll go with this one, because why not? Grab our free money, and off we go. Kill the Wigglers from hell, and uh, progress.
Ooh, another tarot. Increase curse attack damage by 1.25. I don't think we have any curse attack. I'm using a godly. Did the ghost count as curse? Maybe. Ooh, another tarot. We're becoming a lucky ducky today. Rolling an enemy will damage them. Oh, perfect. So I've been getting better at my rolls. Ah, oh, overall weapon damage increase. That sounds great. I'll take that. Already having a godly. That seems like it might be a bit overkill. If I don't get through this boss battle, I will be mad. No, and no. We a pillar draped in spider silk. Beautiful. We get, ooh, another tarot. Hey, which everything went hit. I'll take the extra heart. I ain't gonna complain about more hearts. This should just, at some point, just auto. When I enter the room, just give it to me. Shouldn't have to make me press it. And same with destroying everything. After you get to a certain caliper, it should just be like, here, all of it, enjoy. No. No. Okay, I don't see anything floating, so I don't know where our possible tarot drop would be. But we're just ripping through these areas with this godly sword, so I ain't complaining. Oh, you're lovely. Oh god. A little bit of bullet hell. Come on, just slash your way through. There we go. He was cuter as a big monster, but we'll still take him. We'll take the beet roots, I guess. Okay, last area for this area will be next time. Hopefully we'll have another good run. Cleansed the non-believers. Yeah, we'll take a couple days at home, get our spare hearts up, and make sure everybody's happy. I guess we just lost here, Joel. Go sleep, bud. having tummy issues oh yeah I need to feed him <laughs> being dumb I'm like what do you want <sighs> there you go babies eat up level up Trinity again Yeah, we're all able to have a hail of resurrection again if we decided to.
No Russ. Go bed. Ow! I better deal with this. Forgot that somebody died. Yeah, I think something that would be a major improvement is like make a super leveled up like seed silo that you can like dedicate a certain seed to and it fits as me like infinite of each one, you know what I mean? And then same with the poo, like the poo can automatically go in it or whatever. Or just make it so like an upgraded bathroom where you could just they could just pull the poo right out of the bathroom <laughs> which just sounds weird but it'd just be like an option to make it not so manual on you that they could do things more themselves and debate and put more seed silos in they don't take much not much but i mean it's something Chop trees. I can go buy followers frequently from the guy out here, too. I'll take them. Just get my middle manual slaves. I can even uh, start another little garden thing on the other side. That might be a good investment because we're going to start needing food growing pretty fast. And you would, ironically. Um. Uh, do you seriously want something? What? <sighs> I'm sorry, buddy, but no. It's too much of a pain in the butt right now. Okay, now we should be able to make the farmer station. Make it right here. I like how even though Russell's told to uh, chop wood, he prioritizes build building the farmer station, which is kind of strange. Oh my god, I'm out of grass. Let's uh, cancel this one. Let's see who, uh, well, let's do our sermon first. And then let's see who is either a archer or a melee. Targets a random enemy and explodes towards them. Vfar might be a good option. Yeah, we might be going with Vfar. Um. Okay. Let's see how they play. Oh, now we have a necklace. Okay. What's up, Kazi? My friend and I were traveling together through Enora and lost each other. Can you please see if you can find them? No, baby. I'm sorry. Can't get everything you want. Mommy's got to put her foot down. She's preparing for something else. No Spider-Man. Oh man. It's it's just funny how some of them just walk up to these people like, Oh my god, oh I'm so happy he died. It's like weird. I get they have that like trait or whatever, but it's like still just low. <laughs> it's nice just collecting your free crap from your followers. <laughs> This is all aesthetics, but I might tear it out just to <laughs> put more of these in. Because pretty is not profits. Kid! 
Seriously. I lose 35. They're all gonna be freaking mad at me, so I, now I gotta do a ritual. Thanks a lot, child. It's like when you peed all over the house. I love you, but I'm mad. <laughs> now you guys get to do no work today, because of my cat. Nobody ever asked me any more stupid questions. Enjoy your day of no work. Okay, we're trying to get up. What's his name? Where is he? Did he die? No, oh, he's right here. That's far. Okay, sorry boys, but uh... Trinity, come on, my little baby. Russy, my buddy, and we're gonna give Vesfar a try. And we're also going to I'm curious if I can bring Tear Jewel back. I guess Tear Jewel's just sacrificed to the buddy. Well. <sighs> For old times' sake, let's bring back Mammer. Maybe Russell will get a kick out of that one. Be like, I hate you! <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was the cow I accidentally murdered. Well, I guess, uh, Tear Jewelist no longer exists. So, yeah, let's head out. Five becomes, becomes nothing, nothing at all. The duty I owe to my brethren cannot be shirked. My temple awaits. Okay, buddies. Let's see what we got. Necromantic axe. That's not a bad one. And it knocks back some poisonous enemies. That's not bad. That's a decent start. Alrighty, dude. I envy you not. While you may yet kill me, still I will not trade places. It is time to draw this ugly business to a close. He waits at the point of the sharpened blade, the fate that cannot be outrun. He waits with the eye of raging storm at the end of a long day done. All that for three lousy coins. Rude. Rude, sir, I say. Um, we don't have any indication, so let's go this way. I'll take it. Fervor win hit. Cool. Okay, we still got an actual tarot room. That's good. I was getting worried there for a second. I'm like, am I not going to get a normal one? So I would like my bonus card sooner rather than later. Um... Yes. <laughs> that was loud, but I want that. Um, immune to poison when hit down to blah, immune to poison. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's just go down, see what this is. Can you not? Nah.
Get an extra half a heart. Bad. See what's lying in wait in that other room. Never know if it's something good or something bad, but probably bad. Yeah, bad. But hey, I'd rather know than not. Especially since I got a bonus heart out of it, so that's good. It was worth the shot. Yeah, I love those bonus heart ones. They're so good. Like, 10% chance of killing an enemy, and when when you're killing 200 plus freaking enemies, it's like, pretty good chance you're gonna get some hearts. Got a tarot card room, which might be a good option. So if I take the tarot card room, I can get the vegetable room, which would get me here, and then I could actually go to the rock room and right to there if I feel like I have a good setup already. And pretty good setup. It deals poison damage or file projectile. I think poison damage might be more effective at this moment. Um Yeah, let's just go for it. I think we're pretty good set. A pro we usually die the first time against the boss anyway. So. <laughs> because I don't know how to approach them yet. Okay, we're at the area. So hopefully we can just whiz on through here. And I'm immune to poison damage if I believe, yeah. So I don't have to worry about poison points on this round, which is a good bonus, especially since more than likely the boss is going to be poison based heavily. We got Necromantic Sword. Mmm. I do like the sword better, so I'm gonna take that. I just feel it gives me more of a speed freedom. Yes. Thank you. Actually, let me be annoying and slash all your belongings because you might have secret life for me. Oh, uh, this is where I miss Tear Joel. Boop, I'll take that. If it'll let me boop it, boop. Okay. Am I ready? No. But I gotta do it. Okay, boys. Are we ready? You better carry me. He of havoc, he of blight. She of hunger, they of might. Five becomes four, becomes three, becomes two, becomes one, becomes nothing. Beautiful. Just what I was expecting. God. This is terrifying. <laughs> you didn't like spiders, you're definitely not gonna like <laughs> this battle. Oh. Can I just like... 
Ignore him. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen, let's be real, but I got pretty far for being what it was. <sighs> hey, if we can get our bomb boy up, we might have a bit of luck. <sighs> Who's dissenting? Sir. You should have better right now. Let's burn the cult down, make everybody happy. I love purchasing people specifically to make them do manual labor for me. Just saying. It's a great thing in games. Not in real life. <laughs> Y'all good, bud? You ready to be let out? Oh, I guess I, uh... Resurrected somebody who at one point was buried. I'm like, why is there a hole in my ground now? Luxury meals out. We treat you guys well around here. We just ask you to do manual labor. Great leader, I like you. No, I love you. Would you make me the happiest creature in the world and marry me? Um... You are my cat's sister, so marrying my child, technically, I guess. I guess I adopted your brother, so you're not really my kid. Either way, it's weird, but whatever. If that's what you want, we can do it. Let's get hitched full. I mean, my other husband's dead, so. From before, not my actual husband. My husband is fine. Very much still with me and still in love. But the in-game husband has passed away a while ago. I married Frigri. You happy now? You got that wedding ring, are you gonna stop, uh, complaining? My faith in you is justified. Delicious fish feast. Yeah, we can do that. We'll wait until, uh, daylight. We'll cast the fishy thing. We'll get you your fish feast. Fishy wishies come to me. Now I'll go suck every soul out of the fish in the ocean. So my kitties can eat. Wait, can I just buy them from him? Kind of expensive though. Should definitely have enough now. Because frankly, I don't like fishing. Russell, get your butt over here. My faith is renewed. He's still doing praying. 
farm. Is this manual label worth it? Or should I just <laughs> fill in that entire area with these things? <laughs> I don't know. Because let's be real, past when I get to a certain point how much wooden stuff I'm really gonna need. <laughs> 